All right, y'all, so I just watched footage on Demetrius Andre. So I'm gonna be making a fast prediction because I don't wanna make a super long whole prediction. So from what I've seen from Demetrius Andre, he can he knows how to work on the inside. And, oh my God, this is a much closer fight, I think, than, than I, okay, so I originally thought this was like maybe a 70-30 fight in favor of David Benavidez because I'm taking in the factor of where Demetrius Andre started out, which was at 154. But again, when he went up to 160, he seemed like he was doing fine with this power there. And then now he's going up to 168, which either he's going to be stronger at 168 or he's going to get destroyed by David Benavidez. And when I say that, I mean, because David Benavidez has been fighting at that weight for quite some time and from his last fight with Caleb Plant, as you can see, he's taking his training more serious now. We He was in great shape for Caleb Plant. And from what we're seeing on the media, I'm gonna pop up a picture. You can see he's in great shape now for this fight. And he's taking this fight very serious. And now I do think Demetrius Andre is giving him too much credit, which he's like, I think he's power this and this and this. But it makes sense because he's like, if I beat this guy, I'm, I'm gonna hype him up because I'm gonna, I'm, I feel like I'm gonna beat him. But I feel like he respects him too much, so. I'm gonna be very biased to say, I'll give this fight a 60-40 in favor of David Benavidez just because of the weight, the weight class factor, him coming up to 168, and then David Benavidez, his performance coming off Caleb Plant because he did very well, he boxed, and he couldn't get him out of there, but he was boxing him, and he beat him. He beat him brutally, so this is my prediction for this fight. David Benavidez is most likely gonna win, 60-40.